These nine RuneScape creators will compete in this video for 250 million GP. They'll have to make their way through a series of unique challenges. One by one, they'll be eliminated until only one remains. Today's champion will not only win the money, but they'll also earn a spot in the One Remains Hall of Fame. For their first challenge, they'll each have to hop on a sled and race their way down the Scrubfoot circuit. The person with the slowest time is eliminated. Everybody on your sleds. Three, two, one. Go. Wait, why, why am I walking? What's going on? Wait, am I walking? Yeah, why am I walking? What the hell? I had absolutely no idea this thing ever existed. But this is actually pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Oh, the speed boost makes you go fast. Here we go. Oh, holy sh**. I am trolling. Yeah, I'm trolling right now for sure. Oh, I play so much Mario Kart. Rainbow Road, we got this. Oh, right, it's going so well. Let's go. Man, I'm pretty good at this. I'm not even going to lie. Oh no, I started walking. I've not gone on any of the slow rocks yet, so that's good. I swear I could barely see this. <laughs> if you mess up once, you just start walking for better long. Oh, I'm going so fast. The end is bad. Oh no. Is that it? Mate, there's absolutely no chance I'm out. 105. <laughs> 105. Woohoo! Okay, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. All right, I'm done. Dang, I didn't even get a personal best. I guess I have done this before. There we go. 111. Wait, what the? I got grizzed. Wait. Okay, I'm done too. No! Oh my God, I gotta hit the jump. Come on. Okay, I'm done. Only 10 seconds separated first and last place in today's race. Torvesta and Reese had the fastest times with one minute and five seconds. Eviescape and Z Cookies were the slowest at one minute and 15 seconds. Oh. <laughs> Since only one player can be eliminated in round one, Eviescape and Z Cookies need a second race to decide who gets out first. Good luck, guys. I was a little bit late on the slide in thing. No pressure, yeah. guys. One miss click is over. One miss click is over. Oh, my <laughs> yeah, God. Oh, God. I'm so much slower this time, too. Oh, no. Dude, I'm zooming this time. I can't even lie. Oh, f you. You're not. Oh, God. I'm so slow. I picked another path and I was like, oh, maybe that's the thing. Oh, dude. I got a world record. That's a world record for sure. Eviescape zoomed his way to a win in the second race, which means Z Cookies is the first person eliminated. Good luck, gentlemen. F sleds. For challenge number two, the remaining eight players will be competing in Sketch and Fetch. They'll have to watch me draw a RuneScape item. As soon as they figure out what it is, they have to go and get that item and bring it back to me. Last person to bring the item back loses. Oh, I've got it. The luck, guys, obviously. What the, what the hell? What is that? <laughs> Easy, bro. I haven't the slightest idea what this is. What on earth is that? Hamburger? I don't know. <laughs> 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 what kind of meeting? I feel like bro. Like, what the f What is that? Oh, what? Wait, that's, uh, wait, wait, okay. Oh, oh, okay. I, think okay. I, I think I might have it. That's the one. <laughs> oh, I think Give me the right one. Oh, right. oh, oh, I already got oh it. okay. Fucking burger. Oh. <laughs> don't worry, oh. guys. It's nothing. <laughs> I have no idea. Guys, that looks tasty. Bro, yes, you got it! Come on, quick! <laughs> no way. F yes. That's actually, you know what? Honor, yeah, really, really, that's a like good drawing, bro. Time. Come on, no, dude, no fucking way. You get yes. RG on the snow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm not the last one, it doesn't matter. Oh, am I last? Crap. My impeccable drawing ended up being some cake. Tierzu wasn't feeling cake today and instead brought a triangle sandwich. Oh, wait, I didn't even get the right item. I got a triangle sandwich from pickpocketing the dude by the Tower of Life. <laughs> <laughs> he was unfortunately last place, which means he is the second player eliminated. You can eat the sandwich. Uh, any final words for the boys? The sandwich is pretty good, though. I think I'd prefer it over cake. Your next challenge is called Clean Shave, and I've got some tips to help you out. If you're still pulling out your ball hairs one by one like I used to, you need to stop. Manscaped's 4.0 performance package will change your life. It includes the Lawnmower 4.0, an electric trimmer with a ceramic blade designed to reduce grooming accidents for a mega precise shave. It's even got an LED light on the front to help you navigate those trickier areas. On top of that, it's waterproof and has a cordless charging system, which is really handy. You'll also receive the Weed Whacker 2.0 nose and ear hair trimmer, the perfect tool to keep those pesky nose and ear hairs under control.
control. It doesn't stop there. You're also getting the Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant and Ball Toner Spray. Nobody wants bad odor down there, so apply these after you shower for all day body odor protection. When you order the Performance Package 4.0 using my code, you get 20% off plus free international shipping. Just use code SUPARS. You'll get two free gifts as well, Manscaped's anti-chafing boxers and their shed travel bag. Everyone I talk to loves their Manscaped products, and I'm sure you will too. I've used Manscaped products for three years now and highly recommend them. They're pretty much all I use. So head to manscaped.com slash SUPARS where you'll get 20% off and you can see what all the hype is about. For challenge number three, everyone will play a classic game of Gilligesser, aka RuneScape Hide and Seek. Every minute, they'll be shown a slightly larger picture of the location I'm hiding at. Once they figure out where I am, they'll have to make their way to me and trade me. Last player to find me is eliminated. Wait, what? <laughs> Damn, 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 that's a hard one. Bro, if everyone else is stuck, then that's a good side. Wait, how do we use a fairy ring? What's the nearest one? Ferox Enclave. Ferox Enclave fairy. Can you not tell where that is from the blades of grass in the photo? Like... <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the way the book is as well. I'm, dude, I'm normally pretty good at this and I have no f yeah, clue what that is. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm thinking fell the pills. I don't know that. Nobody was able to find me after one minute, so I had to show them picture number two. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, Does that make things better? <gasps> oh, I know where it is. I think. Yeah, I know where it yeah, is. Yeah, well. yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, come on then, Solo. Let's go. Oh, no cares, though. I hope you know the fairy ring, buddy. The fairy ring? What? What's a fairy ring? Let's f***ing go, baby. Whoa, okay, <laughs> yeah. great. Number one. We're going the right way right here, surely. We're literally on the same tile right now. We're on the exact same tile. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this is tick perfect. Wait, we're in different spots. Do I not know where this is? No, I went the wrong way. Oh, peace, peace, peace. I got it. Oh. I thought I was in the right spot. I couldn't see you guys on my f***ing mini map. I was like, wait, did I go the wrong one? Oh, hell no. Where's the nearest fairy ring with these teleports? I had to run from Pharaoh. No, oh, this part just went to a random campfire. I don't play this game, bro. I'm about to be walking in a second. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 there's another. There's a walker. Well, where the f did you go for the fairy ring? I ran from Pharaoh Enclave to Edgeville. Really? It is, what? It's <laughs> Wait, I'm guessing everyone's there then. I'm oh no. The correct location for today's Gilligesser was at the Eagle's Peak. Framed smoked everyone with an impressive time of 1 minute and 54 seconds. Reese wasn't able to find me in time, which means he is the third player eliminated. That was fun. Good fight, I guess. Good luck. Six players remain, and for challenge number four, we have to bring out some trivia. <laughs> Yay! They'll have to guess how many tiles it takes to get from the start of the Agility Pyramid all the way to the top. <laughs> what the? How does this guy think of the sh**, bro? Bro, you ask me an agility question, I lose. When I say go, they'll post their guesses in the chat box. The person with the worst guess is eliminated. That's if you go over oh. an agility jump, does that count as a tile? Bro, no, it does not. Can mind. you walk on that? That makes a difference. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh yes, highest. in the middle. Yes, no. in the middle. Oh, no. God. I'm the highest. Wait, 200 feet. Oh, no. oh, my God. Everyone went so high. Okay, so the correct answer is 145 tiles. Oh, 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 oh shit. I'll see you guys. Thank you for taking the bullet from me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the correct number of walkable tiles it takes to get to the top of the agility pyramid is 145. Solo mission was the closest with a guess of 181, only 36 tiles away from the right answer. MMORPG was a bit farther away with a guess of 280, which was 135 tiles away, which means he is the fourth player eliminated. Uh, I'm gonna go do some agility pyramid. See you guys. Up next, I asked if the remaining five players were subscribed to me on YouTube. Fortunately, all of them were so nobody got eliminated. Make sure all of you are subscribed as well and leave a like to see more One Remains episodes. For challenge number five, the remaining players all have to score a goal in a game of Skull Ball. They'll have to race through the course by kicking their skull through a series of goals. Their time ends when their skull gets kicked into the final hole. The player who takes the longest to score a goal is eliminated. Three, two, one, go. Come on, the one and four. Oh, oh here you're they come. Kidding me, bro. Yeah. Come on, here man. they come. <laughs> Yes, come on. You're kidding me, bro. Oh, come on, man. Wrong way. Oh, no. Oh, I'm in, I'm in. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Oh, no, what have I done? Dude, I'm f***ed. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Oh. What the? Oh. 
Oh no. No! A couple times score their goals, bro. <laughs> what are you doing? It like bounces off the wall and stuff. That's so troll. Wait, what? You actually haven't got through that goal yet. Bro, this is so f Wait, who's who's yeah. in the bag? Hey. <laughs> hey <dude. laughs> Wait, that's yours. <laughs> when does this thing end? Holy shit, there's so, so many goals. <laughs> Damn it, dude. I f suck at this so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so fing gone. <laughs> that's why I made this so What a fing hated you for life if you made Sabani. Ooh, this is the most agility training I've done in the past three years. That's insane. Hey. He shoots, he scores. Get oh, look at a little dance animation. Wait, what's this a mirror, dude? Yes. Yeah, over here, over here. They follow the arrows. Go, go, dude. Dude, hurry up and eliminate me. Come on. Let's go! Framed was the last player to score a goal, which means he is the fifth player eliminated. He did mention, though, that he's excited to give Skullball another shot. Skullball f sucks. I'll see you later. <laughs> Torvesta, Solo Mission, A Cold One, and Eviescape are the final four remaining players. To earn today's final prize, they'll have to earn some GP themselves by competing in the world's fastest money-making challenge. Each player will only have five minutes to make as much GP as possible, starting just with the teleports in their inventory. Whoever makes the least amount of money is eliminated. Your time starts now. Let's see if we all pick the same thing. Jared, I wonder if anyone else is coming with me. Oh, you. Where is he? Ah, oh, here he is. Oh, you're talking about our good friend over here. I'm talking to my friend. You have some pickpockets on me now. Mate, what on earth? I've had zero time to think. I don't even know why I've teleported here. Why did he even teleport here? I don't know why. There's no way you're thinking about doing this all kill. There's no but shot. Surely. Snake versus snake. All right, I mean, hopefully I get like good RNG on Zora. That would be pretty handy. I'm going picking up a f iron bar. I don't know. No, I'm not doing that. Why? <laughs> no way they don't sell. <laughs> oh my God. I'm actually f this, I, like, I'm done. It's just over. <laughs> what is there, God? You gotta leak. You gotta leak, bro. Fucking frog's legs, bro. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you fear? Like, what do you fear? What do you fear? <laughs> they're worth 300 and they're not going for 10 GP. They're worth what someone's bought... willing to pay for it, bro. Come on. Oh, I, bought, I knew you were gonna do that, so I bought them out on alt. They went for one! <sighs> It's all over, bro. There's there's someone in the world as well. I, I nah, mate. I'm gonna PVP. Well, no, I, I'm actually begging. I could get my RNG so so easily right now, please. No. Yeah, it's okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. I'm at a severe disadvantage. Uh, I'm 74 on, so I can only lay four traps as well. If I went black chains, I could lay six. Oh, we're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> I'm just, I can't just give it up, bro. It's over. Like, what the f I've literally just been absolutely f violated by the GE today. How much are chins? 800 GP. You're taking the f piss. A red chin jump is 800 GP. All right, guys, 10 seconds left. Today's top earner in those five minutes was Solo Mission, who made 87,088 GP mining Runite Ore. Torvesta made 8,853 GP hunting Red Chinchampas, and a cold one earned 7,303 GP pickpocketing Arty Knights. Unfortunately, Eviescape was absolutely violated by the Grand Exchange and was only able to muster 3,139 GP, which means he is the sixth person eliminated. Thank. I can go back to bed. Goodbye. Three players remain, and one last challenge stands between them and 250 million GP. For their final test, a cold one, Torvesta, and Sola Mission will race from Lumbridge Castle all the way to Verox Center, but they'll be blindfolded. By turning on the green screen and hide widget plugins on Runelight, their clients will turn completely black. For them to make their way to Varrock, they'll have to right-click on their screen and try to determine where they are based off what appears. By adjusting their camera angle, they can also get an idea of the buildings and objects around them. The first person to get to Varrock Center wins. Three, two, one, go. Okay, this is <laughs> such a cool challenge, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, oh no, I messed up my camera angle. Oh no. Wait, I see Solomon. <gasps> 
Wait, what if I follow him? Wait, so I can see oh, I can see myself running over the bridge. That's kind of cool. Um, I, I have no idea where I am right now. Wait, someone's already getting attacked. They're attacking a cow. Okay, that's the cow field right there. Oh, technology. Wait, I'm seeing moves, bro. <laughs> I'm just seeing Moo go off. Okay, I see a cow. <laughs> uh... <gasps> Oh, oh, this is bad. This is really, really bad. I think I'm in the cow pen. Chop down tree. Bar. Willow tree. Oak tree. Hey, who's Vasquin? I hope he's going the right way here. Why is he- how is he still running? Like, how does he know where he is? I don't understand. The cow pen's actually such a trap. Chop down willow tree. Oh, no, 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 no. All right, I have like zero. <laughs> I have no point of reference right now. There's just trees. Wait, crate. Oh, okay, crate. That that must be that must be that farm, right? <laughs> what if I'm on the other side of the river? Oh no, I can't even right click anything. Oak tree, quack. That's bad. <laughs> Where, have I gone the wrong way? Where am I? Stand market stall. Oh, Wait, time, what? time, time. You Mark made it to the center. Go. You're here. You're here. <laughs> you made it. Let's go. You made it to there. I can hide you. you can hide your green screen. Uh, oh, uh, my days. Wow, you actually made it. That was so fast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at the Dark Wizards. Wait, I'm in Varrock. What? What happened? Uh, Solo made it. He won. What? You're in Varrock Castle right now. You were zooming. What the f***? It only took solo mission one minute and 22 seconds to get to Varrock Center from Lumbridge. Torvesta comes in with another second place finish, and a cold one just misses out on taking home the GP two episodes in a row. Today, solo mission is the one who remains. He takes home the 250 million GP and earns a spot in the One Remains Hall of Fame. Thank you very much. Winner of One Remains Challenge, winner of season four Guild Not Games. Thank you very much, Steve. If you enjoy this series and want to see more, don't forget to watch the previous One Remains episode on screen now, and make sure to leave a like on the video and a comment about some challenges you'd like to see done again, or some new challenges you think would be fun for another One Remains video. A big thank you to all the creators who competed today. Don't forget to check out their channels and let me know which creators you'd like to see in the next episode of One Remains. I'll see you next time.